Um, so I have a less than four mile day today. I'm hiking down to the parking lot and I'm meeting up with Sean and then we're gonna stay in a hotel. So I'm really excited to see Sean and get a shower and do my laundry, get actual food. It's gonna be great. It's top of the notch where I stayed last night. So kind of see the pond over there. Sterling Pond. Another view of the pond. Waterfall right there. You see that? A little white line. Oh, kind yeah, of it kind of looks probably, like one. Yeah. That's pretty sweet. She's like, must zoom in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can't just walk on these. No, no, no. You have to slide. <laughs> these are so slippery. Blue sky! No way. Uh -huh. oh. Blue sky, baby. <laughs> people taking the gondola up. You know, I thought the same thing when I went up to J Peak and like people were w riding it up and it was just all clouded in. I was like, what's the point of that? Yeah, right? <laughs> I didn't realize how difficult this hiking would be down to the parking lot, but it is very challenging. <sighs> and I'm glad that I'm not doing any more hiking after this today. Made it to the parking lot. My first trail magic. No, that's I know. Barnes Camp Visitor Center. Playing a game with the babe and a beer in a room in Stowe. These are some things I am removing from my pack. Face mask I have not needed. This book glide, I'm not having any chafing whatsoever with my two sock system. And the scoop, I haven't ha needed this for water gathering at all. It's been, water's been okay. And I'm also bringing a lot less food. Um, I had a bunch I didn't use, so this is going to be for the next day and a half. I have another Ziploc bag for the, the following two days. It's day eight. Parked at Stowe Mountain. Resort, ready to continue the long trail. Got some friends coming, joining me on this section. And Shan. What's up, baby? <laughs> Having some pre-hike parking lot beers. Woo, light the pack. <laughs> <laughs> lighting, lightening the pack before we get started. I washed everything, including my shoes. They are so clean. Like, probably almost as clean as the day I got them. It's awesome. I smell amazing. So, the plan for today is to hike up Mount Mansfield, and we're going to stay at either Twin Bricks or Taylor. Taylor Lodge? Taylor Lodge. And it's going to be either like six or eight mile day. My backpack looks so small compared to Sean's and Dave's, really. And dude, I fell and went out and I put my hand out, I hit my wrist and then like I smashed the side of my, luckily I had my helmet on. Finally, headed out, it's 11.30 on the trail. Yeah. Well, no, there's a lot of little trails and shit through here. We're about to climb up there. Back in the green tunnel. They, they uh, like if you get there mad, they run, they run stuff like that. 
You lose energy that way. So like the you can generate oh cool you can this see is the Taft oh, Lodge. This is awesome. This is really well kept. Ah, it's very warm in here. Okay, no tenting above 2,500 feet. Starting to get some nice views. What'd you find? Uh, we can go out to Adam's Apple that way. Is that that way? Yeah, I don't know. Cool. On a side trail up to the Adam's Apple, you can see the chin up there. This is baby two climbing up the Adam's Apple. Wow. Climbing on top of the Adam's Apple. Really nice 360 degree views up here. View of the trip so far. Uh, yeah. This is like straight up. There's a lot of different trails. There's a ton of trails off the top. Really cool trail. We're at the map too, so. Oh, cool. Uh, it's only really like this section, but still. Yeah, that's true. It's a couple hundred yards, but. <clears throat> the other way shorter, you know. There is kind of an easier way too, like around to the yeah, left. Yeah, why are you going this way? I, I, she watched me go up there. Oh. Yeah. yeah that's I, a, was I was trying to remember, I'm like, I don't remember climbing up that. <laughs> no, it's just a like, staircase right over there. Oh. I missed that too. Oh, well, the <laughs> ladies decided to follow the Sean path. Uh, the Sean way. Sean way. Just straight up. The way of Sean. <laughs> that's super cool. Glad you guys made it out. Yeah. yeah mm -hmm. Two weekends like of dep deprivation and FOMO and fucking silly movies. Oh, that's ravens. So cool. Ravens. Cool. Straight up. Now tell me, do you really want to know? Me forever, oh, oh, oh. Look at Kyle just making it look easy. <laughs> Here comes Dave. of people at the top so I don't know how long we're gonna want to hang out there <sighs> up on the chin 
Any footage of you hiking up here? I would love that. Yeah, it really looks like that. Like Jefferson. I guess we didn't know for sure what we were going to be doing. But all things considered, he seems to be doing pretty well in Easty. This is my fourth Vermont 4000 footer. I just have one left. I mean, I'm gonna plank, climb the other three this trip, but I already climbed them before. So, baby shoes fourth as well, I think. We're on top of Mount Mansfield. Made it like long trail. And Sean and Sarah and Kyle and Dave are here. America Beautiful views. That's what I'm gonna go for too. Look at this amazing Sour's ridge line that we're gonna hike. Towers warm, we're not very good. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. I'm like, I'll probably stand in that. Absolutely beautiful yeah, day today. Yeah. Couldn't have asked for nicer. After <laughs> six days, seven days of rain. <laughs> I finally get a view on a 4,000 footer in Vermont. Now Sean will come back to Vermont. <laughs> Um, so Sean felt it was necessary to open up a trail beer in honor of our friend Brian. Yeah, and it's celebrating me actually getting some views on a 4,000 footer in, uh, in Vermont. And it's the tallest one, so why not celebrate? All right, so he's having, he had a beer at the top and now he's having a beer for the road. I love Brian. <laughs> <laughs> This way to the subway. Some tree cover. Woo! Slippery. This is such fun hiking this ridge. This is probably like my favorite day of hiking so far. <laughs> On top of the lips. <clears throat> it seems came like from over there. I guess the worst of the resort is across the street. Hiking that way. Yeah. Wow. See him cruising down right there. Oh, what is it? It's it like it's oh, burning it. Oh, oh, wow. That makes sense. That thing's I long as hell. Where are they going? I have no idea. I thought they were going like straight down, but they're going sideways. Huh. Dude. Must be a like a thing yeah, that they stop at and then go down. Big beard. Yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, they're over there. 
Coming down the forehead. But I probably would, I wouldn't go much. Too quiet. Got our first ladder going down. Oh, make it look easy. <laughs> like a ballerina. You can do it, baby! Oh, just skipped half of the rungs. <laughs> uh, I don't know, since I'm using a ladder, I don't need. Toss your pole, I know. I'll grab your bag. I have no idea what's happening right now. I'm gonna toss you my pole, baby, when you grab my bag. <laughs> How about I grab your pole? Well, that, that'll help you. Looking drop. It is, yeah. yeah. It's not where you want to fall. Nope. How I saw oh she uh, lost her bag and her pole, so I was like, oh my god. It looked like it wasn't gonna fit. I think this pole's provocative. Oh, yeah, there's a little drop here. This is where I don't want to fall as I scoot up and over this little rock. No, no support here. No support. Here's Jenny. Scooting down. <laughs> Apparently there's a hundred foot drop off on that little wooden bridge here. Oh my God. I'm waiting to assess this for myself. Here's a little area we came down through. Here's the little bridge. Well, it's not really a hundred foot drop, but you can get caught in some trees on the way down. Pretty cool little plank bridge. Out into this. Shazam. Jenny and Dave down there. Looks like a nice little view. Boom! And more rocks and ladders. in there for you. Nice. Um, so this guy follows my YouTube channel, so he's gonna see that. That's hilarious. <laughs> that guy follows your YouTube yes, channel too? Yes, he does. <laughs> <laughs> I totally did it in a goofy voice too. I'm like, oh, where we go? <laughs> There's Butler Lodge, Twin Brooks, and Getting set up at ten, Twin Brooks tent site. Got my hammock set up over there. Your Sean's tent. Got a nice big fire pit here. Looks like a nice place to watch the sunset. Picked up this beer yesterday at the beer store in Stowe. It's a B Burlington Beer Company and GMC collab beer. 5% of all sales will be donated to the Green Mountain Club. There's a little blurb about the long trail on that. I just thought that was so cool. I had to get it.
Ang Sem <laughs> gnocchi with white cheddar cheese sauce and bacon, real bacon pieces. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so Dude, talk about hitting the jackpot for a mosquito. <sighs> Like, what is this? There's like, our campsite. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> nice tender meat. Mm -hmm. It's 10 a.m. Starting out on day nine on the long trail. Just left uh, Twin Brooks tent site. Headed south toward Duxbury Window. It's going to be a long day if, if I can make it. Uh, <laughs> it's going to be a close to... 20 mile day, which I've never done before, but once we summit the first peak, uh, it's downhill. downhill and it should be nice uh, switchbacks <laughs> and then flat for the rest of the way. So you just have to make it over this first six miles and then it should be pretty smooth sailing. 200 miles. Here we go. Here's Jenny passing the 200 mile mark. 200 more miles to go. <laughs> to mass, she travels. <laughs> Ooh, beaver pond over here. This part kind of reminds me a little bit of the... Here's Jenny ascending the ladder as we climb to Puffer Shelter in Bolton Mountain. Made it to Puffer Shelter for lunch break. Really cool view of what we hiked yesterday. There's Mansfield over there. Pretty awesome. We're at 3,700 feet right now. Here's our viewless summit of Bolton Mountain. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, wow. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, marshy area. There's a stream running through. So this is Harrington's view, and you can see that's Mount Mansfield over there where we were hiking yesterday. Looks so far away now. I remember you. <laughs> Jenny and Dave approaching the Winooski footbridge. It's nearing the end of a very long day for us. Get over the bridge, finish a road walk to the car, and it'll be 18 and a half miles. Here we go, apparently. I think so, yeah. Oh my god. Holy 30 cow. Anyways, I think. Nope. Uh, <laughs> Thank you.
chicken farm. Look at all those chickens. Dave got electrocuted. <laughs> zappy zap zap. <laughs> There's a bull in the trail. Like the one that was had the little, not a bucket lid, but where that wire was, you know? Yeah. We're gonna go around the cows. I thought this was just going to be a road walk. I did not expect to be taking off my pack and crawling under electric fences. <laughs> We're about 0.4 from Sean's car and I am in so much pain. <laughs> this is the longest day I've ever hiked. I'm leaving behind my pillow and my bug nut pants because I haven't needed them at all. Got a ham and cheese wrap. Some good cheddar and cheese. Beer. Thick cut. Just hanging out in the parking lot. <laughs> After an 18 mile hike. Uh, Ugh. <sighs> 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 